Hey there, welcome back to my channel, Losing with Shannon. So this is a what I eat in a day. I think I taped about three to four weeks ago. I know it's a little late, but I never got a chance, never remembered to tape my intro. So again, I am not a nutritionist. I am not a doctor. I'm not saying you need to eat this way. This is how I ate when I was following Trim Healthy Mama while following some calorie counting. I know some people are like, hey, you don't have to count calories. The thing is, I don't think some people understand some people like me need to have some sort of way to limit their portions. After I kind of get myself, you know, in that routine, I don't need to count. I can intuitively eat for about three months. At three month mark, I stop losing weight because that is my goal. And uh, that's because my portions, especially when it comes to cheeses and stuff like that, does get bigger. So for right now, especially where I've been struggling the last year, I need to train myself to prefer those healthier options versus the heavier calorie options, which is where calorie counting and all that stuff comes from. If that's not how you believe, that's not how you believe. But yeah, that's what I have to do to control my weight. And I am a I track Bites coach, which means I just give people support. And if you want to use my coach code, it's down there. And that just gives you $5 off and then I get a little bit back. Uh, doesn't cost you more, you obviously get $5 off. So it's a coupon code technically. So you to do it on the iTrack Bytes website. So I hope you have a great day. Enjoy the video. I'll see you guys next time. Bye. This is my breakfast. Three eggs, okra, bacon, Cream in my coffee, one tablespoon is acceptable in a deep S. This is a deep S meal. And hopefully it's gonna be a good day. Update for my what I eat in a day. I just did a 30 minute walk away the pounds. Later on I'm going to do the last day of the Chloe Ting challenge, but I'm not gonna eat after this workout even though I I, saw, I feel like the the THM explanations on fueling after workouts is a little loosey-goosey so I really don't know if a walk really can cons <laughs> this lighting really requires nutrients right now I still feel full I still feel full from uh, breakfast so yeah just did a workout 30 minutes walk away the pounds nothing crazy it is what it is So here is lunch. It is the hot bacon salad from Trim on the Table. I mean, really, it's, it's eggs and bacon and hot sauce, like in, on lettuce of some sort. I didn't have half and half. I just got hearts and rings made today, yesterday. So that's lunch. This is my favorite lunch. I just worked out, so I guess I deserve this. Okay, so here's my dinner. This is my dinner. It is a uh, chicken. I don't know what kind of chicken is really that I was given. Uh, brown rice. I only chose a fourth of a cup. Salsa. Some fire and hot packets. I found it was a Diablo sauce. I think it's Diablo fire. Lettuce. Some sprouts and sour, full fat sour cream right over here. So that's my dinner today. I'll probably make some tea. I did take a picture of my snack earlier, but I didn't tape. It was about 200 calories, and I haven't added the rest of the cheese up, but I'm looking at, looking at about probably 17, 1800 calories today, which is a little higher than I prefer, but I don't actually think I actually had eight ounces of chicken. So I'll have to like measure that out and see what it looks like. Uh, and like guesstimate back. So this is my dinner today.